Audubon coming in around an inch, Newton close to an inch, a city of Des Moines between a half inch and an inch, about an inch before midnight or a half inch, excuse me, before midnight and around a half inch after midnight. Ames reporting 0.84 and some high totals also around Osceola. We've got more rain on the way, but this rain will be ending by 9, 10 o'clock this morning. It will be staying cool with rain falling again Thursday into Friday. And yes, it is looking warmer next week. Many of you have been asking for that and it's coming, but you have to get through a couple more cool days. We're at 43 right now. The winds are out of the north gusting as high as 26 miles per hour. This is where the heaviest rain fell so far in between Fort Dodge and Atlantic. Some inch to two inch rainfall totals coming in and it's still raining around Fort Dodge right now, but the heaviest rain is now closer to Iowa Falls and lifting off to the east northeast. Marshalltown waking up to some rain Montezuma Belle Plaine. We also do have a few showers just to the west around around Guthrie Center. So this low is moving out and behind it will be some drier air. Now that said, we'll be left with some drizzle early on with more clouds throughout the afternoon and then the clouds break up for a little bit tonight and build back in throughout the day tomorrow. But tomorrow looks mainly dry throughout the day. I am seeing pockets of heavy rainfall through the state on Thursday with similar rainfall totals to what we're already dealing with. Some areas could even get some higher amounts as the system will not push out until Friday afternoon. It will be drier on Saturday and it does look warmer on Sunday. Sunday there is a chance of some isolated thunderstorms as it gets warmer, but overall, I think you're going to like the temperature change. Now, additional rainfall totals. This is a system Thursday into Friday, dropping an inch plus across most of the state. 50s today, 60s tomorrow, and it looks like 70s by Sunday. 54 today. Again, that rain ending early cloudy, a bit breezy. Tonight, temperatures will fall to around 41, partly cloudy tonight. If you have outdoor plans tonight, it will be cool and dry. Tomorrow does look dry, mainly cloudy, 61. On Thursday, wet, 53. That's the day I'd be pushing my outdoor plans inside. On Friday, it looks cool and wet. Once again, 58 dry on Saturday, 63. On Sunday, 74. On Monday, 82. Now, I did make a few changes to the weekend forecast. I lowered the high on Saturday but I upped the high on Sunday and Monday. And those are only isolated storms early and late in the day on Mother's Day. If you still have a picnic planned with mom, you should be okay. Maybe get her shorts and a t-shirt too so she can enjoy the 80s in full on Monday. Today's weather rating does look cool. And because it's going to be wet this morning and in the 50s this afternoon, it's only four in my book on this tired Tuesday. Yeah, because it's gross out yeah. right now, but 